previous class we have studied about terrestrial plants and all the terrestrial plants can be categorized as follows the first one is the plants on hills and mountains second one plants in plains third one plants in hot and damp areas fourth one plants in marshes fifth one plants in desert so we have learned we have discussed about plants on hills and mountains the examples of these are pine fig deodda spruce etc today we are going to learn about plants in plains our lesson name is plants on earth our lesson name is plants on earth so today we are going to learn about the second one plants in plains so before going to learn about the plants in plains let me explain the climate how does the climate will be in plains so we all know that in desert areas the climate will be very hot whereas coming to the hilly areas the climate will be very cold whereas coming to the climate in plains okay the climate in plains will be the climate in plains neither too hot too hot as in desert areas as in desert areas so just now i said that in desert areas the climate will be very hot the climate in plains neither too hot as in de desert areas not too cold in hilly areas this is about the climate okay the climate will be very hot neither as in desert areas not cold in hilly areas and coming to this plains will receive a moderate rainfall plains will receive plains will receive a moderate rainfall Cool during the 
winter during winter to protect why they why they shed their leaves to protect themselves from loss of water to protect to protect themselves to protect themselves from loss of water and again they get new leaves again when they receive when they get the new leaves in the spring season in spring season as just now i said about the flat leaves okay all these flat leaves will help water vapor to evaporate and keeps the tree cool during the summer season and all the trees will shed their leaves okay when they shed their leaves during winter during winter season they shed their leaves why they shed their leaves to protect themselves from loss of water and again they will get again sorry they will get new leaves in the spring season when they receive and they get the new leaves in the spring season the examples are mango neem shisha gulmohar mulberry these are the examples examples of plants in plains okay once again i'm repeating this part okay the climate how does the climate will be the climate will be very hot as in desert areas not cold as in hilly areas coming to the plains all the plains will receive a moderate rainfall and coming to the leaves the leaves will be broad and lightweight okay why because they can capture so that they can capture a lot of sunlight to make their own food and coming to the flat leaves what is the use of the flat leaves all the flat leaves will help water vapor to evaporate water vapor to evaporate and keeps the tree cool during the summer season and they shed their leaves okay all the plants all the trees will shed their leaves in which season in the winter season in the winter season they shed their leaves to protect themselves from loss of water and they get new leaves in which season in spring season the examples are mango neem shisha gulmohar mulberry are the examples of the plants in plains now we are going to learn about the third one plants in hot and damp areas so in these areas the plants will be having lots of leaves in these areas all the plants all the plants will have lots of leaves so plants in hot and damp damp sorry damp areas we can see all the plants will be having lots of leaves so they cannot shed their leaves okay though they have lots of leaves many leaves also they cannot shed their leaves they cannot shed their leaves they cannot shed their leaves in winter season whereas coming to the plants in plains all the all the plants will shed their leaves in winter season whereas coming to plants in hot and damp areas they cannot shed their leaves in winter season they remain evergreen throughout the year they remain evergreen the examples of these are take rubber pepper coconut are these examples of the plants in hot and damp areas so just now i said that all these areas okay or in these areas all the plants will have lots of leaves okay though they have lots of leaves they cannot shed the leaves in winter season so always they will remain evergreen throughout the year so the examples are take rubber pepper coconut okay children today we discussed about plants in plains and plants in hot and damp 
áreas 